Hi, this is Brad with Copper Creek Cuts. Some time ago, I discussed switching from plastic gas cans to metal gas cans and wanted to give you a quick update on how that was going. The short answer is very well, so, you know, if you want to click off the video now, you can. And when I talk about plastic gas cans, don't think I'm trying to bash Sure Can or No Spill. I haven't tried either of those. My experience with plastic gas cans is gonna be the, the Walmart variety. I will say that the problems I experienced, some of them are gonna be universal to plastic gas cans. Even the manufacturer of those cans on their website say things like, we'll never be able to eliminate swelling or you know disfigurement of the gas can because of expansion or contraction. So some of these things are gonna apply no matter what plastic gas cans you have. And the other thing is that this isn't a promotion. Just Right and I have no affiliation. You're not gonna find Amazon links in the description where you can buy these. There's only really two brands that I found that make these type two metal safety cans and that's Eagle and Just Right. Both of them get great reviews. It's not like one is worse than the other from what I could see on the online reviews that I read. But what I did find is that Just Right was consistently between $10 and $20 cheaper per can. Now that's obviously going to depend on the folks who are selling it on Amazon at the time. But because of that and because of the fact that it looked like just as, as good of a product, I went ahead and, and got Just Right for these gas cans. So now that all that stuff's out of the way, we can kind of talk about what I do like. One of the things that I really, really love and one of the reasons that I had to get a Type 2 gas can over a Type 1 are these flexible nozzles. It is so much easier to fill two-stroke equipment with these flexible nozzles. I can fill it while it's still in the trailer, which would have been unheard of for me to do with traditional plastic gas cans. So really, really love the flexible spout. And that's one of the reasons why I got these type two. The other big reason I prefer these metal safety cans is it's much easier to vent excess pressure. They automatically vent over a certain PSI. And when I do go to fill up, it's very easy to manually vent the remaining pressure by just lifting up on these fill ports. In addition to filling, this was the other huge pain point I have with plastic gas cans. Is here in Florida, things get hot. If your gas can is half full or less, which it's gonna be half of the time, right? You know, until you go fill it up when it's empty. Those plastic gas cans in the Florida heat inside the trailer, they blow up like balloons. And if you take them from that position and put them in your garage, as everything cools down, it sucks the plastic back in and it deforms inward. I hate it. The worst thing is when you're in the field, you get your gas can, your plastic gas can, and it's super bloated, and you don't have any choice but to vent that pressure by opening the nozzle, and gas just spews out everywhere. It's happened to me so many times, or, you you know unscrew it and that takes a lot more time because then you've got to fiddle with that little black safety cap just a complete pain all the way around don't have that issue with these metal cans it is fairly difficult to get the very last little bit of gas out that may be an issue if you're in a colder location where your gasoline sits for a while these metal cans are heavy enough that they are able to support and hold themselves while you're filling them with gas, which means that you don't have to bend over, you don't have to stoop down, you can just put the gas nozzle in, let it go, and it'll shut itself off just like it would if you were pumping gas in your car. Which I find really nice, you know, it's not a deal breaker, but it is nice to be able to stand up while you're fueling the five gallon, the two and a half gallon, and not have to crouch down that whole time. Now obviously I'm not going to be able to speak to the longevity of these since I've only had them for a few months. I'll do more updates as the seasons progress of course, but for right now I'm extremely happy. I think the extra money that I paid is well worth it. The two and a half gallon was somewhere near uh, 50 or 60 bucks and the five gallon was somewhere near 60 or 70 dollars. Don't quote me on those prices and of course it's going to be different based on you know what Amazon sells them at the time. And at least for me, I know there's no way I'm ever switching back to plastic gas cans after this experience. So hope that helped. If you have any questions about metal gas cans, these type two safety cans, please leave them in the comments below and I'll reply to them within one or two days. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it.